Would you please welcome the eighth wonder of the world, Jerry Springer. that they have shocking tales of love to tell. Yeah. And they'll share the bizarre twists and turns of their love lives with us here today. Please meet Stephen. Now, he says his sex secret was recently exposed. Uh, Stephen, what happened? Well, uh, my girlfriend Rachel and I have been together uh, going on two years now. Yeah. Uh, about six months ago, we got serious, got engaged, got our own trailer going on. Uh, <laughs> well, it's a step up, a step up away from home, and I uh, moved in together. Everything was rolling along fine. Uh, I was at another woman's house about three days ago, and uh, knocked on the door, and it was Rachel and uh, the Jerry Springer camera behind her. Yeah! Yeah. 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 What do you think about it? That's not a happy circumstance. So, no, that, yeah, that's right. Rachel, your girlfriend, called us and right. uh, asked us to send our cameras, and she, went, she thought you were cheating on her. Right. And followed, we went with her as she found you. Let's take a look at this tape. Rusty guys down here because, I mean, my boyfriend, he's just gone bad. It's like I come in this daughter every single day. And Bobby's all the time telling me, you know, he's not right for you, he's not good for you, he's cheating on you. Hey, Bobby, can you tell the Jerry Springer show what you saw with my boyfriend the other day? I saw him with another girl. Okay, where do you go? Good night, buddy. We'll see you get her. You know, I mean, you can ask anybody around here. They'll all tell you. Nobody lies around this whole town. See, and even Cindy can tell you about it. I mean, were they in here the other day? Yeah, they were in here by the way, but not close to each other. This is where this bitch lives. I'm going up here to confirm her. That way she knows who is in this relationship. Will you please tell my boyfriend to get his cheating ass out of this skank ass trailer right now? What's the damn oh. camera doing on my porch? Oh, honey, this is a Jerry Springer show because I can't to bust you sleeping with my man to show how big of a whore you are. We're not sleeping together. You've got it all wrong. We're not sleeping together. You don't want to see him right now. Oh, yes, Trust I do. Me. Oh, no, you don't. Oh, no, you don't. don't. I'll ask him if he wants to see you. If he don't, then you need to take your young, unexperienced ass home. <laughs> You really don't want to see him the way he is. I don't care he how he is. He needs to get go home. No, he is right here to talk to me. Oh, well, he'll come talk to you.
You need to get in the car oh, now. No. I don't want to lose you. I can't get in the car. No. Fine. Forget Baby. it. No, Let's forget talk. Let's talk it. for a minute. Forget it. Let's talk for a minute. Come here. No, forget it. Get Are in you the jealous? car. I want, I, I, want ever, I want the world to see how pretty I am. you thinking this this is me that's you this okay. is me uh what what has happened since then uh she you see she's real aggravated about it she wouldn't come up to chicago with me so she didn't come on the show today no you were cheating on her no you weren't no. okay no you, this is just something you enjoy doing yes. do you think you're ever going to be able to keep a woman like that an open-minded woman yes <laughs> This isn't the 50s anymore. It's gonna, I mean, come on. Well, it's not just her mind. It's gonna, her closet's going to have to be open, too. With her. Really bad. I've gone on business trips quite often. Now I know why you took the Viagra. Jerry Springer, mother and son, break the ultimate taboo. That's about as disgusting a thing as I've seen. I'm sleeping with my mama. You slept with your mother. Does that make me sick? Take him! I don't want him no more! That's not wrong with you! I had to fill the shoes of my father. Springer camp shocking video on the next Jerry Springer. to know. Okay, I was wondering who the father of my baby was. All right, let's take a look. The Miss Cleo DNA test. I don't know. <laughs> I'm solely searching for the father of your baby. Oh. It's the one that's very unpleasant, okay? Okay. Um, and he's also the one that had another girlfriend while he was sleeping with you. Yes, he did. Yep, that's him. That's the daddy. Okay. But you knew that. I wasn't sure. I don't know how the baby looks just like him. Yes, he does. Yeah, so you were in denial, because he has a funny little chin, doesn't he? Yes, he does. Yeah, and the baby has that same little chin. Oh, my God. Ooh. The cards can reveal things that you will never see by yourself. Call me now for your free tarot reading. Call 1-800-763-0364. On the next session of Divorce Court, the fun in their marriage was put on hold. You just didn't want to go out anywhere. Did you take her out? I took her out to places like movies. No. Okay. Sorry. But what phone call will spice up their divorce? I want my apartment back, but he moved his friends in. What does it take to get them out of there? Just a phone call. Then make the phone call. Let's go. You just asking for trouble. On the next session of Divorce Court, Monday at 7 on KBFI 27.
A worker accidentally slips and falls at work. He's hurt and in pain. What should he do? Call K Clinic first. At K Clinic, we set your appointment quickly and provide free transportation. You'll see a medical doctor who will diagnose your injury and your treatment will begin. K Clinic also provides licensed workers' comp experts who will take care of all the paperwork and fight to get you all your benefits and a weekly paycheck while you recover. Hurt at work? Call K Clinic. We're on your side. In Dallas, call Clinic 6. In Fort Worth, call 6 Clinic. I think that insurance fella could give me a better rate on my pickup. If you're thinking about buying insurance for your car or pickup, or maybe shopping for a better rate, call Concord. You haven't been behind the wheel since 91. If you have a good driving record, you may qualify for Concord's safe driver discount. Doesn't mean I won't qualify. Hey, guys. Here's your chance. Ask him about your pickup. Safe driver discounts. It's one more way Concord is driving down the cost of car insurance. Now, where did he come from? Do you have a strange and unusual story to tell? If so, please call 1-800-96-JERRY. We'd like to hear from you. guest with bizarre cheating tales please meet paul he says his wife is going to explode when she hears the bad news uh, paul what's going on i've been cheating on her oh that that seems we've been married 45 years Jerry. you've been the married woman 45? is crazy She's crazy. I've been married 45 years. She beats me. She cut off my finger. She what? cut your finger off. What's she going to cut off now that she found out you're cheating? Jerry. Oh. Jerry, I come home late one Saturday morning. You she's what? Shoveling. I come home late and she's shoveling snow and the silly bitch hit me in the head and knocked me out and left me laying in front. Why do, you, why do you stay married? I can't take the beatings anymore, Jerry. Why do you I stay found a beautiful woman that I'm cheating with now, and she treats me like I'm a prince. She gives me everything. You love this, but, the, but your wife, you've been with for 45 years. You must have well, loved her. That's why I'm here on your show today. I wanted Steve and his security to stay between me and her. Okay, but you want to tell her that, so we're going to bring her out here. No, Pull. hold it. Hold it, Jerry. Hell, 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 no. <laughs> My God, I'm, 60, I'm 63 years old. I need a head start. Well, usually that's where I stand, so I don't get hurt. <laughs> That damn right. hillbilly's crazy. You still love this? Do you love this woman, though, still? This new girl? No, love... but your, your wife. No. You don't? No, hell no. Here she is, your wife, Laura. Okay. Laura, Hi, Gary. Hi, Laura. How are you? I'm great. Um, so, uh, how are things going? You're, you got a good relationship? You got a good marriage? You got a... What's going on? Sure, everything's fine. What are you doing up there? I'm, I'm here to tell you, honey, we've been together 45 years, and it's over. I'm through with you. I got a new girlfriend, and I'm going home with her today.
Help me. Where's Steve at? You coward! Where's Steve? You coward! Where's Steve? Next time! Look out, people! 30 on your... Stop her! Stop her! You can't be that surprised. He's done it to you a bunch of times before, hasn't he? Yeah, but we work it out. We talk it out. You're... You think that shovel hurts, you piece of... I'm trying to tell you, I'm just sober. You made me this way. Yeah. Yeah. This other woman when we come back. Yeah. You don't see me using Viagra. Yeah. Very nice. I gotta respond to that. Go ahead. It Just... still gets a damn hard to cat king scratch it. How long has the cat been trying? <laughs> Ever since the dog years. died. Okay. So. <laughs> You need a car to get the most out of life, but banks won't finance you if you have bad credit or no credit at all. Get the car you need and deserve. Call 1-800-BAR-NONE right now. When my child has a fever, I give her medication, and then be cool for cooling relief. Unlike messy wet cloths, be cool stays in place and cools for hours. Be cool for cooling relief. Have an idea? Invention Submission Corporation can help you try to patent your idea and submit it to companies. Call 1-800-727-IDEA for free information debt problems? You may qualify for help under federal law. Under federal law, you can consolidate your debts into one low payment. Here is an example. $13,000 in unsecured debt was consolidated to a payment of only $20 a week. For more details on how this law can help you, call the toll-free 24-hour recorded information line at 1-888-500-3328. Call now. I'm Officer Thomas. What's the problem, man? Well, they're not here. All right. How many were they? Uh, there were four. Two adults and two kids. All right. Can you describe them? Blue eyes, um, hair, light brown. Hmm. Huh. What were they wearing? Uh, they had casual clothes on. Uh, T-shirts, shorts. Mm -hmm. When was the last time you saw them? They were on their way to San Antonio for vacation. The fifth time this week. Saving so big, your vacation will last longer than you planned. Call 1-800-THE-ALAMO or log on to SanAntonioVisit.com. Get your own San Antonio vacation experience, Scott. You'll enjoy discounts on parks and attractions, hotels and restaurants, great shopping, cool car rentals, incredible golf, tours, and much more. So call 1-800-THE-ALAMO now to receive your San Antonio vacation experience guide. Hey, it's free.
You'll have a hottest time in the coolest city in Texas. Call 1-800-THE-ALAMO now. Check out San Antonio, where the story never ends. If you just joined us, we've been talking here with Paul and Laura. They've been married for 45 years. Uh, Laura, a feisty young lady, uh, not, not too happy with the fact that Paul's behavior cheated before, and you've kind of gone after him when he's cheated before, haven't you? Yeah. So he comes on the show now and says, you've done it again. Got a beautiful young lady now. She won't be. Yeah, do that. All right, here's this other woman. Do you know that he's married? Yes. Why, and hell yes. Why would you want to mess around if you know that he's married? Does it look like he's happy? Because she's a look slut. Look at his hands. <laughs> I mean, would you be happy with her? I sure wouldn't. Oh, he, be with he may still sleep with her, but he's got Linda on his mind. What do you oh, want to say? Trash. What do you want to say to her? What do you want to say to her? You'll not have him. Yes, I will. No, you won't. Yes, I will. I tell you, every time I he see you, here. I'll stump you. If over 45 years he keeps cheating on you, why do you want to be with him? Well, he doesn't all the time. Oh, he doesn't all the time. Because I watch him. I told you, she's a mad hillbilly. You made me that way. Okay, so you, uh, how long has this been going on? About a year. How'd you two meet? At an airport. At an airport? See what that tell you. How soon after you met her did you have sex with her? That night. Are you still living with your wife? Hell yeah. On and off. Well, you liar. I've gone business trips quite often. Now I know why you took the Viagra. Oh. Probably didn't need it with you and he won't touch you. <laughs> Loser. Yeah. <laughs> Here. You know good and damn well I can turn you on faster than that thing. Oh. When was the last time you had sex with your wife? Uh, Monday. Okay, so... A week ago. So you obviously haven't lost interest in her. Well, it was one of them more or less help her out situations. <laughs> respond to that. Go ahead. It Just... still gets the damn heart of cat king scratch it.
we doing? <laughs> okay, so, uh, how long has the cat been trying? <laughs> Ever since the dog years. died. Okay, so. <laughs> Okay, I'm joking around here. Is this so? This is your marriage. Seriously, are you are you honestly telling? You talk to your wife now. Are you really telling your wife 45 years is over? It's just, over. It ain't either. It's over. You'll be back. You always come back. Oh, it's no. over. You'll be back. I got. It's over. Me. Sorry, folks. I got me. people moving all my as we speak. What? No good. Well, I tell you one thing, you better not take nothing but the shirt on your back. We'll be back. Free tickets to the Jerry Springer Show. Call 312 321 5365. They both have credit problems. He got a secured credit card because it looked like a good deal. She got a Sterling Silver Secured Visa and MasterCard plus a savings account. He was unaware of the hidden fees limiting his available credit. Sterling let her determine her own credit line with no hidden fees. Regardless of your income or credit history, Sterling Bank & Trust will guarantee you a Visa or MasterCard or both, and you determine your own credit line. She's secure. With him, it's a nightmare. What messages do the spirits have to tell you? Did she either get up and leave, or did you get up and leave? Yes. In some dramatic gesture? Yes, I uh, did. You did. And I was wondering, the hermit card here tells me, and you are very frustrated with the whole situation, aren't you? Yes, I am. The judgment card says to move away from it. Okay. Your two of cups is in a position that if you move away from the situation, she will cry, she will struggle, she will be fine, though. You hear what I say to you? Uh-huh. It is time to go ahead and close that door, brethren. It is over. There is a secret, too. What is good? There is a lot of stuff going on between the two of you. Yeah. Yeah, because he is still involved with this other individual, correct? Correct. And that is the secret, correct? Correct. Exactly. No matter how you want to try and fix it up for Miss Cleo. Yeah, I think he spirit, found out anyway, don't you? Yeah, you hear me? No matter what you say, I always going to be told. You're free tarot reading, I'll wait. Call 1-800-360-1164. Over half the people who apply for a Visa or MasterCard are rejected. Here's a promise from Sterling Bank and Trust. Open a savings account for as little as $200 and you'll receive a Visa, MasterCard, or both. Guaranteed. If you're a U.S. citizen at least 18 with a verifiable home address and social security number, you are approved. And with our five-day express service, your Visa or MasterCard will be mailed five days after we receive your deposit. Whether you're starting out or starting over, start with Sterling Bank & Trust. Call now. She was 15 and I was 17. I was nervous about getting married. Joe and two people too young. And I was working three jobs and I was modeling. Mia was always trying to live outside of our means. He wouldn't work for like weeks at a time. It was not uncommon for her to go out on shopping sprees. For better or worse, rich or poor, a passion for justice. Judge Joe Brown. Monday at 7.30 on KDFI 27. We're single professional men. We're the cream of the crop. This spring, we're getting married. Pow! There goes my buzz. There's nothing like a good woman to the <laughs> to make a brother want to be a man. And I'm not afraid to tell you I love you, Denise. The brothers. What y'all want to drink to? To love. Oh, hell no. Do something else to the brothers. Great dollar. Opens everywhere March 23rd. We've been traveling the state, talking to Texans, finding out what's important to them when they shop for car insurance. Uh-oh. If we're real quiet, maybe he won't see us. Guess we better wave. Turns out what you care about most are low rates, financial stability, and fast claims handling. They're what Concord works hardest at. 
City boys don't know about hard work. Uh -huh. Call us. At Concord, we're driving down the cost of car insurance. Does someone you love work in the sex industry? Do you want them to stop? If so, please call us at 1-800-96-JERRY and tell us about it. They have a secret tale to tell. Please meet Amber. She admits she's been hiding a huge secret in her love life. Amber, what's going on? Well, Jerry, I'm lesbian and... You're a lesbian. <laughs> this is... We have never, ever had a lesbian on our show. Okay. What's that? <laughs> okay, go ahead. So you're a lesbian, yes. And I've been dating this woman named Becca for two years. I'm her, her first girlfriend. Yeah. And I'm just tired of putting up with it. She's self-centered, egotistical, materialistic. Oh. That's all she cares about. Yeah. And I'm here to tell her that I found somebody else. You wish someone... Oh. <laughs> Does someone else has lesbian tendencies as well? Yeah. Yeah, she's a lesbian too. Ooh. Okay. Is this the first time you're cheating on her? Mm-mm. Oh, so... But she, kno but she knows about the other times. She mean, knows about the other times. And she's cheated too, so... She's cheated. Okay. All right, well, I'll let you... I'll let you just tell. Do you think she suspects this? No. She, okay, well, here she is. Here's Becca. You're welcome to the show. Thank you. Yeah, I need to tell you this. I'm a guy. Uh, okay. <laughs> no, really? Okay. So, uh, you two have been together, what, two years? Yes. Okay. And you love each other? Oh, yeah. Very much. Good. Um, what did you want to tell her? Um, I'm sorry, but, you know, for the last two years, I've put up with you being self-centered and just caring about yourself and how you look, and not, I found somebody else that listens to me and loves me and takes care of me the way that I should be treated. And I don't want to be with you anymore. Why would you do that? Because you're so self-centered. All you care about is yourself. No, all I care about is uh, going up in the world. And you just want to uh, stay down wherever. Well, isn't that what being a lesbian is about? for three years, two of those years, taking care of it, your ass, sitting here paying all the, all the rent, paying for whatever cost that you need, your cigarettes, your whatever, and you know, this, this is fine, you know, this, that's messed up, that's totally messed up. Let's meet this other woman.
She bought it for me. You know, if you pull that. You know, you know what? You can hey, keep it hey, because you know what? No, no, no. Why don't you pull your second chin up and use that as a token? Why don't you keep it? Why don't you keep it as a reminder of what you lost? You're honestly saying that you don't want to be with her anymore. I don't you want to be with her. I'm with her. You're with her. relationship my first one ever for two years and you know what I'm sick of you and you using me and I need some Got a cold? Get over it. In initial clinical studies, Zycam significantly shortened the duration of the common cold. Get Zycam and get well sooner. Your period? Missed it? Now there's a clearer line between being pregnant or not with new improved Clear Blue Easy. Period. With a beautiful voice to glorify the Lord. She wants him to sing for all the riches and fame. Don't miss Can a Woman Make a Man Lose His Mind? Starring Montel Jordan, Jackie Clark from the world famous Clark Sisters, Eric Williams from Black Street, Carl Payne from Martin, and Lamar Campbell. Can a Woman Make a Man Lose His Mind? Coming to the Dallas Convention Center Tuesday, March 20th through Sunday, March 25th. I was a passenger. The driver and I were hurt in a car wreck, but we can't afford treatment. Where can we go for help? Call Kate Clinics. At Kate Clinic, no money's required on your first visit. Many people don't have the cash resources for medical treatment at the time they are hurt. We wait for the insurance to pay. Kate Clinics claims experts will handle your claim from start to finish, and this service is absolutely free. If you're hurt in a car wreck, don't wait. Call Kate Clinic first. They're on your side. In Dallas, call Clinic 6. In Fort Worth, call 6 Clinic. Do it now. Monday through Fridays is when they rule the late night On the scene of the TV screen, they keep it tight 9 p.m. is when you catch the Montel show 10 p.m. is when Marvin Roll gives you more So turn it on, tune in to talk show heaven K-D-L-I, Channel 27 Montel and Marvin, they the baddest combination Keep your ears and eyes locked at the TV station To Montel Woo! and Marvin show It's the Montel and Marvin show What? It's the Montel and Marvin show It's the Montel and Marvin show They say they're pulling their hair out to confront their cheating lovers. Please meet Trista. Uh, Trista says her boyfriend is cheating and she's here to get to the bottom of it. Trista, wh what's going on? Hi, Jerry. Hi. I'm, a I'm a drag queen and my boyfriend told me he's been cheating on me and he said the only way I was going to find out who the bitch was is to bring her on the show. Yeah. Your boyfriend is just a gay guy that likes you dressing up as, uh, as a yeah. woman. Yeah. Okay. Uh, and you, uh, when, how long have you been going with him? Uh, we've been getting together for about three years. Three years. And uh, how long did you, when did you suspect that he was cheating? <laughs> I really, he hit it very well. I really didn't know until he confronted me. He's, he came up to me and told me that he was cheating. <laughs> Were you a drag queen when he met you? Yes. We met at a bar back home. And you always dress like this or just once in a while? 90% uh, of the time. Okay. We're going to meet the woman he's cheating with. Right? Yeah. No. 
He's staying with me. Just remember this. Oh, oh I know. You ain't even got a chance here. I can see what I'm up against. Oh, honey, please. I can see the wall I'm up against. Oh, oh no, not even this turtle-looking thing. He's going home with me, and he's going to stay with me. Bitch of the brick house. Who oh, would choose oh, that over there? Who knows what you even think, bitch? At least I look Who like a woman. Who in the hell would choose that over this? Come on. How long have you been going with him? Uh, I've been with him six months. Hi, Jerry. Hi, how are you? <laughs> How long have you been with him? Six months. Six months. Okay. And did you have any idea that he was with someone else? Did he? Yeah, I kind of knew that he was with somebody else, but it didn't matter to me. It didn't matter to you? No. What, did you ever cheat on him? No. Okay, so you thought you were in a monogamous relationship? Yes, I did. Okay, let's find out what he uh -huh. has to say about this. Here's Dan. Him. No, you, you need get to not touch no. him. No, you need to not touch him. You need to not touch him. He was with you me for... You need to not touch him. You need to stay the hell you away to, from him. No, you need to listen to this. He was with me for three years. Apparently, you, you were just no good trash sling. And you... You need to stay the hell away from him. What is up with that? I treated you good for three... Look, look, look. I do not want to be with drag queens no more. Apparently, you want to. No, I don't. That's why... No. Oh, you are not even one no good bastard. Why did you cheat on her? Him. I... Why don't you tell her? I Why don't you her. tell her? You what? I saw her, and I knew I was in love when I first saw her. No! I did not want to be with her. She treats you like crap. Well, you've I been together for three years, for right? I have to do everything for her, though. The last yeah. thing but living hell for me. Oh, we're not... Who, well, who gets you the can't money? Keep him, can't. Who, who gets to get whatever the hell they want? I, I work too, you know? Well, that's oh, on you for giving it to me, stupid bitch. Work. When you do work, it's hardly anything. Nobody wants to give you any goddamn tips. Apparently, you wanted to give me something because I was with you for what? three years. Oh, you like it. Apparently, not enough. You are not Apparently either. Apparently, not enough. enough. Okay, so this relationship is over. Yeah. yeah. And is there any permanence to this one, or is this just a fling? No, I'm, I'm double drag queens. I'm double them all together. Oh, oh really? You're not playing. Oh. done with drag queens. But you're not done being gay, though, right? No, I want, I'm, I'm still gay. I want to be a man. Steve! Steve! Free tickets to the Jerry Springer Show. Call 312-321-5365. Are you one of those people who still think you can't buy a good quality car because you've had credit problems? Wake up! If you have a job, you have credit. Call Auto City right now at 214-398-8204. Get on the spot financing in less than one hour. When others say no, we say yes. Choose from hundreds of great vehicles. Your job is your credit at Auto City. Drive the car you deserve. Auto City will finance. Us at 1-800-96-JERRY and tell us about it. for Santa Claus and um, Laura, I think her name is. If I were you, I'd have cut off his penis and not just his finger. There's plenty of it left. I can cut two inches off for you. What? What did you say? Speak again? You want? Okay, I have a question for uh, Petunia on the end. What do you mean you're pretty? Where are you getting off? 
prettier than what? Just because you look more masculine than me, that doesn't mean I'm not pretty. I got your mark. Okay, okay. And then the other thing I wanted to say was for um, the girl in the black shirt. What are you thinking? I mean, really, what are you thinking? <laughs> to me, I would take self-centered, egotistical, a thief, a murderer over there. A bitch. Yeah. Okay, come on now. Steve's head. Oh. <laughs>